Guys, welcome back to another episode of Taco Tuesday. Guys, I'm a good old Southern Texas boy and I love to eat some ribs. So in today's video, I'm gonna be cooking up some country style ribs and spicy potato soft tacos. All right, so the ingredients for today's video starts off with this Blue Top brand. It's a curry habanero creamy hot sauce, some mission style flour tortillas, some grown in Idaho diced hash browns, some country style ribs, a couple of tomatoes, a jalapeno, some pre-made guacamole, shredded lettuce, shredded cheese, and multiple seasonings. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make all my dry ingredients to put on top of the country style ribs. So I'm gonna start out obviously with this 21 seasoning salute from Trader Joe's. Put quite a bit in there. Then get some uh, sea salt. Some ground black pepper. Then I got some Fiesta brand ground cumin. Just put a little bit of that in there. Some Mexican style oregano. And then to spice this thing up, because it's gonna be some spicy potatoes. I have some Wicked Tickle Devil's Chili Powder. This stuff, it's just, guys, I can't even tell you what. This was sent in from Wayne Watson and I think he's trying to kill me, but they said it's 100% ghost pepper powder. I'm only gonna put a little bit in because I don't wanna burn my booty too much. All right, so you can see there's all your, the ingredients in here. I'm just gonna go ahead and grind it up. I'm just gonna sprinkle it over all the meat here. So I'm gonna move this over here. I don't wanna touch this powder as much as I can because it's got that ghost pepper powder in there. So I'm just gonna put it over the tops of the meat. Be pretty generous with it. All right. Then I'm gonna go ahead and put this in the refrigerator because I already have some cooking in the oven right now. So this is what it's gonna look like before and then I'll bring out the meat once it's done cooking. All right guys, next thing is just cut up your tomatoes and your jalapeno, nothing crazy. Just give them a few dices and slices. It's not gonna be anything fancy. One of these tomatoes, I'm actually gonna throw in with the potatoes while they're cooking. The other one I'm gonna to use to just pretty much garnish the tacos. Since this one actually looks decent, I'll use this one to garnish the tacos. Put that over here to the side. And then you'll repeat the process with the other tomato. So this can be spicy, so I'm gonna end up leaving all the seeds that are on there. I'm just gonna cut it up into little strips. All right, put that over here to the side. And that's basically it, that's all the cutting I have to do. Next thing is, Put the potatoes in my pot over here. I would have put a pan, but I don't know where my pan went. So I'm gonna cook in a pot today. Put these potatoes in there, throw in a handful of tomatoes, the jalapenos in there, let it cook down. And then by the time that's done cooking, the ribs should be ready to pull out of the oven. All right guys, so I preheated the pan. I'm gonna put just a little bit of oil in there. Then I'm gonna try to put in at least half this bag. All right guys, now that I added in the oil, just add in the pre-cut potatoes. Try not to let it 
doesn't burn you like it just burned me. I'll probably end up putting in about half the bag. All right, so I got potatoes in there. Now it's time to get in a handful of uh, tomatoes. Give a little bit of color. And then a handful of the jalapenos. I'm gonna add in a little bit more seasoning, the 21 Salute, some salt, some of the pepper, a little bit of this Wicked Tickle Devil's Chili Powder, spice things up, and then a little bit of the cumin. All right, you can see it's got a nice color to it. So I'm gonna stir this up a little bit until it starts to brown up. Man, this smells so good right now. A little too good. Ooh, that spice, that devil stuff kicking in. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and add in all the tomatoes and jalapenos. Man, this is gonna be spicy. That is some, it just smells spicy. But you can see it's got a nice, pretty color to it. Oh man, I could barely even stand next to this thing. It's burning my nose right now. All right guys, we'll go ahead and let this cook down for a little bit and then we'll check right back in. All right guys, the potatoes are ready. It's time to pull the ribs out and cut them up. All right guys, the ribs just came out of the oven. They've been sitting for a little bit. It is time to cut these things up. All right guys, I'm gonna cut these ribs up just into little slices, just enough to be able to fill up the tacos. I'll add the potatoes and all the sides in and we'll be ready to start eating. Yeah, buddy. Man, that looks good. Just real thin slices. These country style ribs are very easy to cook. And it's kind of hard to mess them up. All right, that should be enough right there to be able to make my tacos for this video. It's time to get everything ready to go and we'll plate this stuff up. All right guys, we're gonna add on some avocado to the tacos. That's good. Add in a little bit of cheese. Pick this side up right here. Add in some lettuce. Add in some lettuce to the other one. We're gonna add in some of the pork, the pork ribs. Oh man, it's gonna be some good stuff, people. Spicy, but good. Spicy potato and pork rib tacos. Time to add in all the spicy potatoes. A scoop for each one should do. Just throw that on top, why not? I'm a Texan, so we're gonna have some big tacos because everything's bigger in Texas. All right. Last but not least, we are going to be adding in the curry habanero creamy hot sauce. Bending this plate when I move it. Guys, there you have it. Jared's country style rib, spicy potato, soft tacos. These things are gonna taste amazing. All right guys, it is time to eat. Let me see if I can even pick one of these things up. This taco right here is like the size of Dallas Fort Worth. Man, I don't know if you guys can see all that on there, but I have to use two hands to hold this thing up. This one's for you guys.
Mm-hmm. <coughs> a little spicy there. But I tell you what. Those country style ribs, they are tender as can be. Man, those potatoes are a little spicy, but you know what? I like to spice it up. I'm going in for another bite. Oh man, that one's a good one. Hmm. I absolutely love potatoes. Spicy potatoes in particular, they're my favorite. I love my breakfast tacos, dinner tacos. This sauce right here, that Blue Top brand curry habanero, get it at Walmart. It's like $3.50. I seem to get a lot of these Blue Top brand stuff. The I made one with my shrimp tacos. It was like a, a, a lime jalapeno or cilantro flavor one. That was delicious. This one's got a nice kick to it as well. I'm still feeling that, uh, <clears throat> this wicked uh, devil's chili powder right here. Guys, Wayne is trying to kill me. Devil's chili powder, 100% ghost pepper powder. If you like spicy stuff, get this. I don't know where he got it, Look it up on Amazon or Google, I don't know, but it will burn your booty. Guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. It's just another episode of Taco Tuesday at Jared's Place. If you liked the video, hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Man, one more bite for me. Hmm.